What's up you guys? It's Michelle here. Thanks for joining me today and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be decorating my classic spread for this week, so stay tuned for a fun plan with me. wait to use this Woodland Season sticker book from the Happy Planners new fall release. It is so cute and perfect for fall and I'll be sure to include my affiliate link in the description. I always appreciate your support when you shop through that link at no extra cost to you. And I also want to use some of these letters. These are the large Mambi stick letters in the gold foil and I'm just going to spell out fall. thought I was out of L's for a second, but there's another page. Top, I want to have one of these decorative boxes, but with a gold quote, a foil. How about seasons change and so do we? All right. Alright, I want to do some of these mushrooms and leaves and pumpkins. I think this is all one sticker, but I might take the leaves off. Because I want that to be over here. Yeah, I'm just going to take that one leaf off since it goes over into the next day. But if we cover up where it says note and put it there. All right. Put another leaf there. And then we'll do that one. And do the rest right over here. And then we just need a little bit of a brighter color leaf up here. All right, so that's our sidebar. And over here on the top of the F, and I realize I won't have any function for Saturday, but that's okay, I can write it around it. I'm going to use this little pumpkin sitting on top of the F.
All right, now I want to do some of these things in the letters and, you know, falling on them and everything. So if I do these two mushrooms, I don't know if those will both fit. So I'm going to have just that one mushroom there. That's cute. Or should I do another one? I think maybe just one. Then I'll have this rest, this acorn resting on top of the F. And I've got a few more small leaves here that I'm going to put in the letters. I'm going to have this right here. We'll put the rest of it right here. Choose this little reddish leaf on the A. And let's do some of these smaller mushrooms down here on this L. And we'll do this little scrap here. Then we'll do this on the side of the L, this one. And that one there. And then we'll do that one up at the top. All right, let's go ahead and do some function. All right, I'm going to do a little sticker surgery on this box, the one that's kind of like a dashboard box. And this is just the back of a piece of sticker paper that I have left over, and I save these a lot too to put extra scraps on and things. Just because it's a dashboard box, it doesn't mean you have to use it that way. I could either use some of this green border to piece it together or just make a cluster with another box. So I'm going to put that right there. And I'm going to grab a couple of plain boxes out of this new Modern Farmhouse book. They've got just lots of plain boxes. I'm going to get one of this kind of tan color, or beige and have that one coming off of this. And then I'm going to do the same with this box. Well, not the same, but I'm going to make it into just a long oval. I mean, a long rectangle. right here. Actually, I didn't even need to do that because I think I'm going to use a slender box to layer right here. label this. Then I think I want a larger gold quote here. Let's do do what makes you happy right here.
we could do make life wonderful. Let's do it right down here. And then something over here. Actually, let's do seasons change and so do we right here. Since this one's a little bit smaller, I'm gonna put it over here. And put this one right here. I took that little green box up and I think I'd rather do this flag here with a little touch of gold. And I'm gonna pull a couple of boxes out of this Woodland Seasons book. Cause there's the same colors and there's a little bit more of a variety in size. So I think I'll do this dark green here. And then I'd like one over here. So let me see what color I want to use. Maybe like this caramel color. I'll use this one with a little deer on it. So I'll cover that part up. Let's do this mushroom, this will be perfect. And just so it won't be hanging out all alone, we'll put that little leaf scrap there. And then along here, I wanna have a little grouping of mushrooms and leaves and things. right there. And we'll do this leaf. Let's put that up there. And then let's do one of these little like reddish polka dot mushrooms. I want to go ahead and add a flag to this and let's also add one right here and then over here we'll do this kind of brownish color all right perfect I think let's do I want to do that pumpkin there instead of that flag. That's so cute. I'll scoot that over so it won't be right above it. Okay, back to this. All right, let's do this pine cone. I'm 
right there. And then I'll, I'm gonna add a lot of those gold sparkles after I get done with everything else. I think maybe we should go ahead and draw some lines and do some bullet points. Okay, I think I'll add some here. And here. And we could do a few up here as, as well. Okay, perfect. Let's do the bullet points next. All right, for bullet points, let's do the, maybe we should do this reddish color because we don't have much of that. We'll do this like maroon color right here. Okay, and let's put these mushrooms right here. And I don't need any more function here, so I think I wanna just do some leaves falling. Do that one and and that one and one more kind of peeking on the page and I'm gonna go ahead and add this up here Have that there and that one there and there and let's do this little acorn right there and then we can do the rest of it right up here got one more leaf I can use right here the rest of it over here actually I think I'm gonna move this acorn to over here because I think I'm gonna do a box layered off of this one so back in this modern farmhouse The little tiny mushroom sitting up top. And I think I will go ahead and add two bullet points there. I don't have another one this color, so I think what I'm gonna do is switch to like this caramel color with it instead. There are kind of a lot of red leaves, so they'll break that up a little bit. Okay, the only thing I want to add now is a few uh, 
of those sparkles. So I'm just gonna drop those off like these. stars. Put some of these in the sidebar also. Now I just want to add some headers and I think we're almost done. So especially like where I have these lines drawn, I feel like we need something. Okay, like these. Let me move this leaf down a little bit so it won't be right next to this header. Let's do important right up here and I'll just cover that up and white out the rest of it. Oh, I want to do also this mushroom right here. We just need a little something on the bottom over here. Maybe we'll do this priority and just cover up the first line like we did on that other one. All right, and that's going to be my spread for the first week of autumn. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me while I put it together. I love this sticker book and I love how it worked out with the gold foil letters. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and I can't wait to see you in the next video. Bye.